Hello, my name is Alexander and today I'm going to show you how easy it is to use proxies through the Chrome web browser. So let's go ahead and get started. We'll go ahead and bring up Google Chrome web browser in separate window. And to see what is our current IP is, we're going to go to the website which is what is my IP.com as we can see it it shows me my current IP address that my inter internet provider provides me at the present time what we're gonna do is we're gonna go back to the best proxy and VPN website and once you are logged in under your under your username and password you, you should be able to see a similar screen with the different proxy numbers so we will go ahead and copy and copy one of these proxy numbers and I'm gonna go ahead and choose this one right here we'll just copy this proxy address and we'll go back to our Chrome window and we're gonna go ahead and click on this little tool right here in in the right hand side top corner looks like range tool. I'm gonna click on it and then I'm gonna go to the options. On the left side we're gonna go to the under the hood tab right here and then in network section we're gonna click on change proxy settings and we're gonna click on LAN settings button right here and we'll go ahead and put the check mark right next to the use a proxy server for your LAN and we'll paste the selected proxy address and we'll go back and get the port port number and then we we'll switch back and we'll have to click this button again because that little window usually disappears once you switch once, once you switch windows so we're gonna go ahead and click on this button again and it brings up this window back up with our proxy number um, already here and we'll go ahead and delete this port number and we'll paste our port, port number we'll click OK we'll click OK here again we'll close this tab and this window sometimes comes up automatically by itself but sometimes in order for you to see this window you have to refresh the page by pressing either F5 on your keyboard or Control R on your keyboard will do exactly the same thing which will ref refresh your page so this little window which is authentication required window it's asking us to enter username and password so the username is exactly the same username that you're using to log in to best proxy and VPN website as well as the password it is exactly the same password so I'm going to go ahead and copy and paste my username and password okay there we go and uh, I'm going to go ahead and click login and what we're gonna do next is we're going to refresh this page to see if this number right here which is the IP address will change to the proxy address that we just used and I'm going to go ahead and press F5 on my keyboard and there we have it it's working thanks for watching